It's going to be week five. If you're looking for week four, if you notice on the screen, week four actually had a bye week, so that's why there is no week four. Let's see real quick. We got some players to negotiate. We have a lot of negotiating players this year. This is an up and coming guy. I definitely want him for the max contract. We're going to start eating away at our stuff pretty soon. But this is a guy that's, I feel like, it's going to be integral to our team. So we definitely want him. Michael Davis is. Not as much of a sure thing. Let's see, who else are we going to have to sign? Kyle Duggar, I feel like we need to sign. Despite being not a starter, he's like our third best safety. One of our safeties is 31 or 32 years old. Um, so we probably want to pay him. I feel like Robinson is a backup. 3028, we probably won't re-sign him. Griffin, I kind of want to re-sign. Claypool, I'm definitely re-signing. I just like turned him into something. Who else? Not a ton of these people, but that also means that some of the other people will be back. Michael Davis. Michael Davis. <laughs> Pretty good zone and press. Let's make him a decent offer. He's 26. Give him a five-year offer. Play till he's 31. I'd rather go up in the salary a bit. Maybe down to like right at a mil for the bonus. Nice. Okay. So we got him. Scouting. So this is back to like Madden created players, no, uh, no, like downloaded thing. So, pretty much, I'm looking for anything right now that's not a running back, quarterback, or wide receiver. Um, I'd skipped over a couple originally, but go ahead and look at them now. So easy to want to just go after the skill positions, but I have really good skill position guys. Though I do plan on going best available, so that's kind of why I'm scouting through like most of these things. Wide receiver, running back, and quarterback. Though quarterback, I definitely don't need. Running back, wide receiver, I'm gonna wait till their combine stuff to like actually waste scouting points on them. So these people are not worth. Anything near a first round pick. Holy moly. Is there somebody that I only partially scouted, I feel like? Uh, this guy, but I probably don't want to see the last part of his. Second round pick. It's not good, though. And he's man to man, too. Let's not look at him. Um, A center. I feel like we drafted a center. That guy's way better than the center we drafted, though. And he's kind of around where we're going to probably have to pick if we do as well as we did last year. Okay. Do our standard trading. We focus on our quarterback, who's only a second-year guy, and a number of wide receivers that are very young. I'm wondering if Wyatt, our left tackle, should be our focus player, but he's a, a rookie left tackle, and there's not a lot of ways to get them to just like get extra experience. So I'm going to keep him upgrading for now. St. Brown has already passed up Brandon Ayuk. Ayuk, or wherever you say his name. So, And he's hidden development. Whereas Ayuk is not hidden development. He's like normal. Still very good, though, for a young player. I keep getting trade offers. I'm not allowed to trade, per league rules, any more players this season until after the draft, so don't even worry about that. So another good team, the Rams, I remember them last time. They were real good. 
uh, one of the harder teams I played. I barely beat them. So after a loss in week three, I don't want to lose a second game. It's already going to be hard enough to uh, get deep in the playoffs. So I don't want to not have a bye. Since this is NFL 20, there are um, two buys. Whereas in Madden 21 and in real life from now on, there's only one buy because of an extra wild card game. Something to keep in mind. So two buys means that even if I uh, am not the number one seed undefeated like last year, I still could get a buy. Let's look at some big nickel. Le'Veon Bell, I'm not worried about. They also have Boyd. Tyler Boyd and um, Mike Evans. So they have really good outside guys, too. And this team's just loaded. The bye? Oh, yeah, I know. I mean, it did. I almost got people. I got some people back from uh, injury. That's what the bye helped me with. It didn't get enough back from injury, though. Nice. I just saw, uh, I was watching Bell. He was about to get wide open. <laughs> yeah. Well, you just played the Giants, right? I haven't played the Giants yet, and they're in my division. It's a good return. I mean, I played them twice, so I wouldn't be surprised either. <laughs> They're going to call me for holding. It seems like every time I blow a big hole open, it's like, oh, it's because it's holding. I also feel like holding is a much more frustrating call than the, pa the roughing the passer, but that's just me. <laughs> oh oh yeah this is the team with kendricks who caused me to fumble like a bunch last year he's dangerous as hell it's a pretty good second now I don't want more than 10 wins. I know, right? Just give me the playoffs to give me a decent uh, draft pick. <laughs> I don't think this power worked for me last time, but let's try it out. I was actually pretty decent. Gosh, the guy never gets to second level, my left guard. It's always a linebacker just sitting there on that play. Oof. Oh, yeah? Wear your mask? You want me to wear my mask right now? For the stream? Oh my god, the lag! That lag's so bad for me. Oh, 
Let's see if we can get at least the first down here. God damn it. Unless you're a Texans fan. God, I feel like running in the red zone's pretty hard. Oh, he took a step inside and got beat. <sighs> oh, okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bill O'Brien. We are playing D&D &D tonight. Just a uh, public service announcement. I haven't been able to play D&D &D in like a month, so. Finally get back into it. Okay, we're already doing better than last week because we didn't give up the... Oh, oh, I almost spoke too soon. We did, didn't give up the big, big thing. Dungeons and Daddies, okay? It's similar to what you're talking about. I'm a little worried about Bell. Oh, what a freaking hit. That's Mike Evans with the drop there, too. Cover three flat. Only if you're cool. Costumes and dress up. Fumble! Le'Veon Bell just fumbled it! That wasn't even a big hit! <laughs> Booth review. <laughs> Over to... Wow, are you seeing... Like, is there a delay on my end? <laughs> That happened to you, too. Pressing this team is probably a mistake. Oh, my God. He held it forever. <laughs> what just happened? Why did he hold it so long? We have a total of negative 12 yards now after that sack. <laughs> All right. That's terrible. That was a really bad punt. <laughs> like, he didn't get me to return it, but you got, like, nothing. Whoop. Here's my rookie. No. No. I get chased down on every freaking play. You got to be kidding me. It's the second time Kendricks has been like a... Uh, Red zone liability for your coverage. So keep an eye on that. Oh my god, I almost threw a pick. He just shoved the crap out of Ayuk there. Janoris Jenkins. Wide open. Metcalf beat his man on the edge. Metcalf does do the slant really well like real life. It's the deep ball he can't do like real life. <laughs> Close this a little bit. There we go. A little too bright. I 
my hair is crazy right now. Put my hat back on. Getting ugly. That's just pushing on my glasses pretty bad. All right. That's a booming kick. Oh, extra point. I feel like if you get the extra point on a kickoff, it should be like a touchback, but like they start on like the 15 instead of the 25. What do you think about that? Would you be up for that rule? Like get the kickers like really booming kicks instead of trying to kick them short? It's a safety thing, you know? Like that's how you label it. You're like, oh, it's a safety thing. That's holding. Except, let's do nickel cover two. Oh, I almost messed that up bad. Oh, Philip Rivers. Second and 11, second and 11. Let's do outside linebacker strike. <laughs> Gives them more value, though. They've been increasing their value every last couple seasons by making kick uh, kicks harder. Or you want to try to eliminate their influence in the game. You won on the safety. <laughs> oh man, Evans held on to that ball. Oh, what the? It switched it to mine, and then it flipped back around, and then my guy caught it after. Mims? Who the hell's Mims? That one should have been reviewed. <laughs> wow, that guy got completely unblocked almost. They're going to call. Um, I finally get a good deep ball, and they're going to call holding. <laughs> this is the kind of crap that, like, gets me super behind the sticks. And then I end up doing badly. Howard. <laughs> Finally got a second level thing on Kendricks. White has struggled, I'm not going to lie. As much as I like him. A lot of times he's just the guy like getting the tough yardage and then Aaron Jones or one of the other guys comes in and, like blows a uh, play up. Blows open like a big run, or randomly he gets a big run. God. My tight ends are really good, but if they're not wide open, they don't make the catch. Run! Block! Just do the basic things that football is. Hey, 
dropping these wide open things. See, like that. He gets tapped, like two hand touched by the guy, and he drops it on fourth and one. Part of it is don't uh, don't use your turbo sticks though, but uh, it's like the defenders just read it so well and they just don't get on front. Because I'm usually running, I have to turbo because I'm running away from somebody. Now Rivers is gonna do like some clutch trait shit on me. Sometimes the uh, switching between players things like kills me too. Yeah, no, I'm gonna sit on you double coverage. Ooh, that was like a crazy jumping tackle. Oh crap, it flipped on me. Holding. And he's gonna catch it, it better be holding. <laughs> yeah, that's right. What's up, Fear Feeling? How you doing today? Just let it down. It's the end of the quarter. Half, uh, end of the half, anyways. Oh, I didn't mention to uh, the people that were that know the league um, that loss I had. Oh my God! He just blocked me. Um, the law in the loss I had, it wasn't necessarily their offense. I held them to negative rushing yards, and only like a hundred, less than 150 passing yards. It was defense and like holding calls keeping me down. And on their second play of the game, they had a 67-yard touchdown. I was down like the whole game. And then when I was trying to come back in the uh, fourth quarter, I threw two picks. And it was just kind of, okay, well, I'm not going to win this game. But I struggled the whole game on offense. God, there's always like two or three guys just there. No, not a cutout, so formation. I feel like we're getting stale. Whoa, what was that spin move? My stick 
went the wrong way. Oh my gosh. Kendricks again in coverage. I feel like I need to go for this. Just was Bill's corner. Hold on. All right. That was pretty good. Let's see. See if we can ever get anything on the ground going. <laughs> that guy's. Oh. Involved Joseph. That's an old D tackle. Oh my gosh, what is with the line today? Oh my god, what a catch. I thought it was a pick. Finally, OJ Howard kind of showing you he can be good. The Ravens. So do you think it's just a down year for Lamar? You think he's uh, already shown his peak? That's the question. No, go back the other way. You don't care about Lamar? Or that's your team in Madden? It's not your team in real life? The drops. The drops from Metcalf are killing me. Just gonna take the points because I'm up. Oh, Metcalf is a huge disappointment. Lamar's doing fine, but he's nowhere near what he was a year ago. Teams have kind of figured out how to defend him, I think. A little bit, at least. The good teams. Not like the Cowboys. I mean, the Cowboys suck. Oh, that was... Oh, my gosh. Walk it in pretty much. And so I've never met a Ravens player that's not hyped for Lamar. Most La Ravens, uh, sorry, not players, but fans. Most of the Ravens fans like are like all about Lamar. But me and J Pace are both Cowboys fans, and we're kind of meh on Zeke, so. I get it. No, go to cover six.
college team. I mean, it's just kind of like I don't I don't watch college enough to have a favorite. There's a teams that I follow though. Fall A and M because a lot of my friends went there. Um, Alabama. My brother in laws like big Alabama. I wouldn't say like I have a particular like horse in that race though. Ohio? Like Miami of Ohio? Ohio State. The Ohio State. That one. What the hell? Earl Thomas just stood there and let it go over his head. So objectively, should they make it? to the playoff despite only playing what like five games did was that a quarterback keep draw on a two-point conversion by philip rivers what <laughs> Finally, it's here. <laughs> Finally. I think that's like my first one with this team. I think I have a punt return from last year, but not a kick return with this team. Finally had somebody not get run down, too even though he's got the same speed as the guys that keep getting run down. Just keep dropping it back. Ooh. Thought it was about to be another pick six. It was a walk in. He should have got it, but. That was such a bad throw. That wide receiver screen was like destined for a first down. He just played like crap. Oh, yeah, for sure. For sure they lost a bunch of guys, but I'm talking about, like, this year should they be in the playoff with five wins, even if they're five wins and people think they're a good team. Ugh, I never catch anybody. Big plays are the only way the, the computer beats me or, or gets, like, gets points. But they did lose a lot of talent. See, this is what I'm talking about. How many points are they down? And then they kick this. Oh, thanks for the follow. Very much appreciated. God, why are you spinning off that guy? 
White might end up getting benched. Then he does that, though. But that you could argue that hole, anybody should run through that shit. Playing on PC. Playing on the PC version. That's why we're in old Madden still, too. Because we're not going to buy it on a new Madden if they're going to still be effing it up. Bear zone! Jones fighting for it. Don't give it to him. Try the power set. Said Aaron Jones was coming in and White came back in. Oh my gosh. Joseph. That's not Jonathan Joseph because he retired. Get that second touchdown for my rookie. St. Brown. Not that we've actually done any mods, though. Mafia, to be honest. It'd be nice if they had some, though. The problem with the, with modding for Madden is the, the mod teams, like, move year after year. In so many games, their mods come out, like, years later. Yeah, we used to play on PlayStation, but once it came back to PC, my PC is just so much better. Them, uh, my PlayStation, so. Oh, shit. I should have just put it in zone because he's in. He's on fire. I mean, EA. The fact that EA crossplay doesn't exist is all you need to know about EA. You could know nothing else about them. And all you need to know is that. Their sports games don't have crossplay yet. Because also the sports games, like, there's no benefit from keyboard and mouse over the controllers. So, like, it's the... Perfect game to have like a level playing field no matter what you're playing on. Though the EA Play thing coming to Xbox Game Pass and Steam and stuff like that, that uh, that shows at least a step in the right direction. They're not going to get this off, right? No, they're not. Okay. Come on. There we go. Uh, I didn't see till summer. I saw they delayed it indefinitely because they said it's not ready yet. It's in a lot of like hate about it, but I mean, it was obviously set up to be started on console and the Game Pass for PC just came out of beta. So I'm not that surprised. But it's only if you have ultimate anyways. Ooh. Earl Thomas showing why he's still on the team. I thought you said you already canceled it. There's still so much stuff on it, so I'm not even, like, thing. I know I changed the camera angle before the play, and then it, like, 
I still got the interception even though it changed it. They're just giving this game away now that they're throwing a bunch. Yeah, I didn't mean to change the perspective. I was changing who I was playing as, and it just... Sometimes you press a button a little late or something like that. Holy shit. 35? That's the Duggar guy that I said, told Mafia he'd like on his team. Yeah, you back the camera up a little bit like that or that. Oh, wow, they're going to call that incomplete? That's just like the one that they gave me for the uh, fumble. Oh, another one! Just drop every back in these zones. It's working. I hate when it does that crap. It, I'm on Hayward. It's saying I win. And then like three seconds later, I do a swim move to the side, even though it's a power move. Swim move into another guy, and I get no closer to the quarterback. But I won. Remember, I won. Like, give me the bull rush. The bull rush is way more effective if you're going to give me the power and like not actually let me get off my block. Yeah, I won. It didn't mean anything, but I did. I won. I could say I won all day, but what did it actually do for me? Huh. I don't know why I did a spike. I was meant to be pressing Y. Whatever. Just can't, at this point, just do that and go to the next play. Spiking it ain't gonna help. Fake spiking it ain't gonna help. Claypool's on the field. Oh, he dropped it. What? Tell me y'all seeing this. Did I drop that? Or is that a fumble if I if I do it there? No, a catch exactly. And then they have my guy touch him. And look at that punt. This is why I end up losing ga or winning games by, like, do they score a bunch of points on me? It's because, like, end of the game, this happens. <laughs> Just trying to big hit and cause a bubble. Intercept it! Intercept! <sighs> <laughs> Time has run out. I would have thought the Rams, if I lost the Cardinals, the Rams would be a lot more difficult. Kendricks, I don't feel like had as much of a factor in this game as he did last year at the end of the year.
Only 183 yards, but four touchdowns because the running game is just not doing it. Yeah, the cards aren't just really that good. Oh, I need one more sack. Freaking dumb. The amount of crap that Titans get is just dumb. Wyatt Mooser. It's like it's my son. Mm. Yeah, I don't know if it's because I lost some of my, like, really good linemen. Kind of like you were saying, Mafia. About your right tackle being a rookie and giving up a bunch of sacks. Like, I just don't feel like the running game is as strong this year. But I did lose at right tackle. I had... Uh, What's his name? Dwayne Brown. I had... Um, what's his name? The Bully at left guard, and now it's a rookie there. So I have a rookie left tackle, a ro rookie left guard, and they're struggling. Whereas last year, I felt like I had a lot more push. Plus, then the rookie's just not as good as Aaron Jones. Set to ready... Incog beat no toe. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much it. All right. Uh, I'm going to get off because I have to set up stuff for D&D &D on my computer. And then uh, the boys are probably going to wake up in the next half hour to an hour. But D&D &D tonight, if you want to watch. They're fighting dwarves in uh, tunnels. Getting frustrated with it as they constantly retreat and then set up new traps. <laughs> there you go. Soul stream smite tonight. <laughs>